This is Colt here from Necroth6 Gaming. I am bringing you my second build video for Into the Light. Um, I am using two absolutely fantastic Warlocks, um, two awesome exotics and two awesome exotic weapons. Um, you will see the builds coming up and after the builds I'll have footage of both Warlocks doing what they do best and that is shocking the shit out of everything and absolutely clearing the area of ads. I absolutely love these warlocks and I thought I would share them with you. So the thing with both these warlocks, the two exotics that I've chosen to go for basically create Arnic Traces like crazy. The Storm Dancer's Brace and the Fallen Sun Star. And the weapons is the centrifuge. And I am also going to be using the Risk Runner. Risk Runner is absolutely underrated. And at Phoebe's on her channel, she knows all about it. So you can check her out. So when we look at the builds, we're going to be using everything exactly the same, just changing out exotics. We're going to be using the Storm Trance. If you want to, at the bosses, you can change out for Chaos Reach at the flag. But I didn't find it's necessary as clearing the ads in the room was equally as important. And when we look at what I'm running with, I'm going to be running with a healing rift. Um, I'm going to be using an arc buddy on that. And then I'm going to be going for my strafe glide as per normal. Then the ball lightning, you fire this out and absolutely slaps and if you're amplified it gives extra lightning bolts then we're going to be using the pulse grenade we're going to be using that to generate the arnic traces we can be using electrostatic mind on the aspects so arc abilities defeating um, the enemy um, the jolted or blinded will give you the arnic traces and the arc soul if you're amplified this thing will fire faster and hit a lot harder so where every time you cast your rift, you'll get the arc cell. Then we're going to be going for spark of shock, arc grenades, jolt targets, then spark of discharge, arc weapon blows have a chance to create an ionic trace. Spark of ions defeating jolted targets creates an ionic trace. You can see the trend here. And then we're going to be going on to spark of beacons. While you're amplified, your arc special weapon, final blows, create blinding explosions. So on the risk runner and centrifuge, you're going to be getting those blinding explosions on top of all those ionic traces you are going to be generating. So when you look at the centrifuge, overcharge capacitor, sprinting, sliding, firing this weapon, builds temporary electrostatic charge, increasing range, reload speed, final blows with high charge causes explosions and maximum charge explosions, blind targets. So you can be going for the double blind on this. So it is pretty much a guaranteed effect. So with the Fallen Sun Star, Arnic Traces you create move faster and grant you additional ability energy and nearby allies also gain ability and energy when you collect Arnic Trace. And you're going to be getting a lot with this, you'll see in the footage after the build section, the um, Arnic Traces for days, literally. So now we have the Risk Runner. When taking arc damage, this weapon becomes more powerful and resists incoming arc damage. Kills extend at the time in this overcharged state. Also, nothing with Risk Runner when you're getting that chained lightning from those hits. Um, this thing just keeps firing and firing and firing, and you barely need that reload. And it shreds whole groups of ads super easy, super quick. And you're going to be getting those blinding explosions. You're going to be getting your ionic traces back really fast. So the Storm Dancer's Brace. Each target you defeat with the Storm Dancer's Brace increases the damage you deal with it and refunds super energy when Storm Trance ends. This thing's super nasty as well. Um, these two builds I was running today in Onslaught um, were a hell of a lot of fun to use. You can see here the mods that I'm running. Copy these uh, two loadouts that you're going to see here. 
and if you want a dem for them just hit me up in the comments below and i will always provide a dem and i'll always respond back if there's any questions you have so what i want you to do now is use these builds try these builds have fun with them and um, give me some feedback on them okay guys i will see you in the next video and enjoy the up and coming footage Your victories far more than your luck. You like to keep things interesting. Guardians, you have an instinct for battle. 